takes two to fall in love And I can't fall in love without you mm. You don't have to toe the line My arms are wide open for you You gave me your heart won't break You have my hands to take Why don't Darling, time is only saying I am the ocean blue mm. Fly the course and make our plans Tell me all the things you want to do I'd do most anything with you You gave me your heart won't break it. You have my hand, so take it Why don't you? Family and friends of Ryan and Danielle, welcome to their wedding ceremony this evening at Centennial Park. In this place, we take ourselves out of our usual daily routines to witness a unique moment in the lives of Ryan and Danielle. Ryan and Danielle are pleased to have their parents in the front row close to them for the ceremony. And so it is that Ryan and Danielle present themselves to be married today, surrounded by the ones that they love. Being a couple for 10 years, it was quite easy for them to do that. Ryan went first. He immediately said that she is the yin to his yang, and further clarified that although they are the total opposite, they bring balance to their lives, which she also agrees. They always keep each other entertained, and they always try to make each other happy in what it is that they do. Hi, Danielle. Take you, Ryan. Take you, Ryan. To be my husband. To be my husband. I will share my life with yours. I will share my life with yours. Build our dreams together. Build our dreams together. Support you through times of trouble. Support you through times of trouble. And rejoice with you in times of happiness. And rejoice with you in times of happiness. Hi, Ryan. Take you, Danielle. Take you, Danielle. To be my wife. To be my wife. I promise to give you respect. I promise to give you respect. Love and loyalty. Love and loyalty. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. Wear it with love and joy. Wear it with love and joy. Because this ring has no end. As this ring has no end. My love is forever. My love is forever. Now, by the power vested in me by the state of Indiana, it is my honor to declare you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. I am pleased to present the newlyweds, Mr. and Mrs. Ryan Cornus.
I got a good one for Ryan. We're out one day having a couple of drinks for my birthday, and I'm an old man, but he showed up. He told me he's got to work in the morning. A couple hours later, we're having a couple of shots and beers, and there's Ryan dancing around, talking to everybody. Now he's got his sleeves up, showing his muscles. Next day, I get a hold of Danielle, and I said, boy, that guy, Ryan, he's a hell, hell of a guy. A man, he partied all night, went to work. She goes, no, Dad. He called off work and he's in the bathroom. He's sick all day. I met Ryan at the Career Center about 11 years ago. I'm like the J to his not so silent Bob. We've lived together, we've worked together, so many hours spent together. Honestly, it should be me in that white dress, but. Um, Danielle, you've had Ryan's attention since before I knew him. And within the first two hours of us meeting, he was telling me all about the most beautiful girl in the world and how he was gonna be with her. And I was like, yeah, dude, whatever, we're like 17. Huh? What are you talking about? <laughs> to finish this off, Danielle, you look absolutely gorgeous today. I. Honestly, both of you. We all look gorgeous. This is ridiculous. We look gorgeous, but ultimately, Danielle looks gorgeous. I remember years and years ago when you guys were just friends. Ryan liked you but you did not like him at first. <laughs> so we fast forward some years, and Ryan would always tell me that he was going to marry my sister. And I never doubted him. So here we are now, celebrating your love for each other. Ryan, welcome to the family. <laughs>